Hi, my name is Wals, and I'm from Saudi Arabia, and this is 21! Good morning, friends and friars. Friars! We are currently driving to Plano, Texas, Yesterday, we drove 1,167 miles. And today, we're finishing that drive from Sacramento all the way to Plano. But, look who we ran into in Albuquerque. It's the PJ! PJ's here! He's busy with school and finals and all that stuff, but he loves us so much that he came to visit. We're driving a lot today. Lots of driving. Lots of driving. But then we got a show tonight. Let's do it. I'm excited. So I need to figure out a way to make these vlogs where we're just driving for long hours more interesting than just doing time lapses on the front of the car. So I tweeted out to see if anyone has any questions, not like ask anima, but like fun, exciting questions. And uh, let's see what we'll get. We have the first question. Air, you're gonna answer this one. Okay. Hannah asks, how do you know if it's true love? How do you Question number two. Isabel asks, Isabel. what can we do if we feel that fear is stopping us from accomplishing our purpose? Wow, it's getting deep. These are like heavy questions. <laughs> well, I mean, if fear is at the root of your, of your purpose, then faith's not at the root of it. So finding a way to put faith in place of that fear. Wait, everybody, we'll do it together. Here's the knowledge, boom, dropped. dropped. John, you messed it up. You messed it up. Here's the knowledge. knowledge. You're not even looking. Dropped. I messed oh, it up. Oh, gosh. Okay, sorry, sorry. Here's, Here's the, the knowledge, knowledge. boom, dropped. No, it's boom, drop. Here's, Here's the, the knowledge, knowledge. boom, boom drop. <laughs> Got it. All right, my turn. Annie asks, what is your fave thing in autumn? Either, Good one. either high school football even though I'm not in high school anymore. I got, I was voted most spirited in the class of 2009, Crystal right, Lake South right. High School, I'll have you know. So either high school football, or the fact that it's Sweet Bear's birthday whoop, whoop. in the fall. Whoop, and whoop, whoop. <laughs> okay, it's your turn. Okay. Um, again, this is from Annie. What country would you like to visit, and why? Well, first of all, I'd like to preface this, which I will never live in another country. <laughs> because what if another world war happens? That wasn't the question. Okay. Probably either do the Game of Thrones trip, or visit Ireland. Because I'm Irish, and my name means Ireland, and my grandma and grandpa went one time, and they told us about a leprechaun tree where you can see leprechauns. Crystal asks, how do you align personal dreams slash goals to God's will? <laughs> you did with the How to <laughs> right now <laughs> on the spot. Uh, I read your Bible and make sure that your goals are aligned with his to begin with. And go from there, adjust from there. Boom! <laughs> Boom! Wisdom dropped. <laughs> Monica asks. McDonald's or Wendy's? Air is not going to agree with me on this, but I have to say Wendy's because they have better 
salads. The Wendy's salads are actually delicious. They're up there, they're like restaurant quality salads for the most part. In fact, in fact, I just had a salad from Wendy's. Apple chicken pecan salad. You little redhead. Sweet bear, she kinda looks like you with the freckles. Except you don't have red hair. But you got the freckles and you've been doing your hair in the braid pigtails. Like a walking advertisement for Wendy's. All right, crazy people. We made it to Plano. Now, after 24 hours of driving in 48 hours, it's time to do a show. This is John has written some stuff I've made. So, to get right to the point today, I got a little game that I'd like for you all to play. We might just be as blind as those to whom we're trying to give sight. It was the first time that I understood the gospel message in a personal way. But eventually, Ronnie heard my whimpering, and he invited me over to sit down next to him. We finished the show. It went well. It was one of those smaller audiences, like 20 people. But that's not what it's about, and I'm really starting to learn that lesson, I think. Um, and now we're getting food at Cristina's Fine Mexican Restaurant. And then we have a surprise for you. Here it is.